Cats in Art, A History of Feline Depictions Throughout history, cats have held a unique place in the realm of art. From ancient civilizations to modern times, feline creatures have captivated and inspired artists around the world. In this article, we will explore the rich history of cats in art, examining various periods and artistic movements that have showcased these enigmatic creatures. Ancient Egypt is where our journey begins. The Egyptians worshipped cats and believed they possessed divine qualities. This reverence for felines is evident in the numerous cat-themed sculptures and paintings that adorn their tombs. One of the most famous feline depictions of this era is the Geyer Anderson Cat, a bronze statue dating back to the 4th century BC. This sculptural masterpiece showcases the elegance and grace that cats symbolized in ancient Egyptian culture. Moving forward in time, we arrive in medieval Europe, where cats found themselves associated with superstition and even witchcraft. Crude and macabre cat images were prevalent during this period, often appearing alongside witches in dark and foreboding paintings. These depictions reflected the prevailing fear and mistrust that existed towards cats in medieval society. However, it was during the Renaissance that cats started to regain their esteemed status in art. Artists such as Leonardo da Vinci and Albrecht D.A. with tilde one fourth rare incorporated cats into their works, showcasing the feline form with a newfound appreciation. Notable examples include da Vinci's enigmatic drawing, study of cat movements and positions, and D.A. with tilde one fourth rare's exquisite woodcut print, the large piece of turf, where a cat can be seen lurking in the background. These Renaissance artists portrayed cats as intelligent and curious creatures, echoing the growing fascination for these animals during this era. As we move into the Baroque period, cats take on a symbolic role in art. They often represent sensuality, femininity, and the occult. One of the most iconic cat paintings from this period is Judith with the Head of Holofernes by Artemisia Gentileschi. In this powerful and gruesome artwork, a cat is seen clawing at its prey, emphasizing the instinctual and predatory nature of both the cat and its female protagonist. The 19th century witnessed a revival of interest in cats thanks to the rise of the Romantic movement. Artists like the copyright Ophelia Steinlein captured the essence of cats in their works, depicting them in domestic scenes and emphasizing their playful and mischievous nature. Steinland's famous poster, Le Chat Noir, perfectly encapsulates the spirit of this era, with a shadowy black cat perched above Parisian nightlife, becoming an emblem of bohemian culture. Fast forward to the 20th century, and cats find themselves immortalized by the likes of Pablo Picasso and Henriette Ronanip. Picasso's Cat Catching a Bird, a simple yet captivating sketch, conveys the energy and agility of a cat in pursuit of prey. Ron Nip, on the other hand, specialized in depicting cats in domestic settings, capturing their serene and elegant demeanor in her paintings. Today, cats continue to be a popular subject in contemporary art. With the advent of the internet, cat memes and viral videos have catapulted these furry companions into the realm of pop culture. Artists like Balbus and Ai Weiwei have even incorporated cats into their provocative and thought-provoking installations, pushing the boundaries of feline representation in the art world. In conclusion, cats have been a recurring theme in the history of art, symbolizing various qualities and embodying different meanings throughout different periods. From their divine presence in ancient Egypt to their association with witchcraft in medieval Europe, cats have truly left their mark in the art world. Whether they are depicted as mysterious and enigmatic creatures or playful and mischievous companions, these feline companions continue to captivate and inspire artists across generations, creating a lasting legacy that transcends time and culture.